federal government is proposing a buyback program of $1,337 for AR-15s under their mandatory firearms buyback program. This is a price for the program that they've now put out, proposing the $1,337 in compensation for turning in the AR-15 rifles under a mandatory buyback program. Public Safety uh, of Canada released that the price list uh, is detailed for how much money is uh, owners will get for banned firearms are expected to get under the program. Now, as the higher end of the scale, forfeiting a Swiss Arms GS550 could uh, net an owner $6,209. And this was based on an input that Ottawa got from the industry and in saying that the compensation amount is um, until it's available until August 28th. And they're saying that on the list, they're on the buyback program, there's more than 1,500 models and variants of what the government considers assault style uh, rifles banned two years ago. And they're saying that, um, you know, this is a way that a price that they initially paid for, that's how the pricing models come up with. But now when it comes to opponents, well, there are some opponents, uh, such as the consum conservative MPs, saying that, uh, you know, this buyback program uh, that's designed the, to be able to have gun control measures, well, they're saying that it's not going to affect when it comes to the shootings that are experienced in the GTA or other parts of the country because those are usually illegal firearms and not legally owned firearms that can be traded in for the buyback program. Saying that it will be mandatory for owners, uh, the, so the program saying it will be mandatory for owners to take part in the buyback program, have their designated firearms rendered inoperable at the government's expense or otherwise lawfully dispose of it. And they're saying that that amount is uh, based on uh, what they paid for for the assault style rifle prior to May of 2020. Um, we're going to let you know what this means. But the Liberals also tabled a firearm control bill in May that would put a national freeze on importing, buying, selling or otherwise transferring handguns.